हे गाइस वेलकम बैक एम आई ए वन हैज गोट ऑफिशियल स्टेबल ओगत सिक्योरिटी अपडेट पेज जोन ओरियो एट पॉइंट वन एंड दी अपडेट साइज इज फोर हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फोर पॉइंट फोर एम बी इफ यू आर करेंटली रनिंग प्रीवियस बिल्ड ऑफ नाइन डॉट सिक्स डॉट फोर देर इज नो स्पेसिफिक चेंज लॉक अबाउट दिस अपडेट इट सिंपली सेज इम्प्रूव सिक्योरिटी एंड बग फिक्सेज कंसिडरिंग द अपडेट साइज आई एम होपिंग दे हैव फिक्स सम इशूज एंड बग एम आई ए वन हैज इन दी प्रीवियस बिल्ड about the update notification i got this update directly without clearing any app data so i think this update is being pushed for every mi a1 user i have done downloading this update so let's reboot the phone and finish the installation process as you can see i have a unlocked bootloader so you will not face any issues with updating or installing this update if you have a locked bootloader The reboot sequence is done and the update has been installed without any issues. Some people or some people on XDA having issues and not being able to install this update. It could be related to Google camera. In case if you are facing this issue or a failed update, just perform a factory reset and try to update again. So let's go to system settings about phone and as you can see OS version is still Oreo 8.1 and security patch level is August 5. and the build date is august 14 and the bill number is 9.6.5.0 os features and all they are just the same nothing new you have the same camera app and i just hope shami provides an update to the camera app with portrait mode on front or back with android pie update talking about the camera app shutter speed is fast no lag while clicking multiple pictures Frankly speaking we have got nothing in the camera app and OS since last December there is HD icon on the status bar for the Vivo LT or HD calling in previous update many were facing network drop in my testing there is no issue with the network and calling via Jio Vivo LT have no issues also regarding the fingerprint accuracy fingerprint unlocks the phone in about a seconds i feel it's slightly more responsive than before Five fingerprint for notification in gestures is also working great, and under Play Store it shows my device is not certified because I have an unlocked bootloader, and if your bootloader is locked, you will see a certified here. Talking about the notification LED, which is just to be static and not blinking with the previous update, has been fixed now. As you can see, now here it's blinking with new notification, and some users had issues with rotation. when they play a video in full screen mode and i tested this with youtube app and i did not face any issues regarding the audio and video playback no issue with video playback and with sound via headphone jack call or loud speaker about the charging from 0 to 70% it charging at an average rate of 1800 milliampere so expect charging time of around 1 hour and 45 minutes from 100% charge Moving to the benchmark scores, Antutu version 7 score is 79,371. The Geekbench score for single CPU core is 815, and the multi-core score is 3954. So that's it for now. Hit the like button if you find this video helpful. See you soon in a next video. Till then, I am signing off. Bye bye.